Sari and Nathan and today in this PSLE 2016 paper 2 question series I'll be going through question 5. In my channel I aim to help all of you master all those concepts out there okay so let's jump straight into question 5. So this is question 5 and this question is testing us on a concept called gap and difference okay so let's read the question first. A total of 18 light bulbs are set up at an equal distance apart along three sides AB, BC, and CD. So AB, BC, and CD, okay? Of a rectangular platform. The figure shows a part, shows part of the setup. The breadth of the platform is 260 cm. What is the length of the platform? Okay, so now that we have read the question, we should underline and highlight the key information. Okay, so a total of 18 light bulbs are set up at an equal distance apart along three sides A, B, B, C, and C, D of a rectangular platform. The figure shows part of the setup, the breadth of the platform is 260 cm what is the length of the platform okay so this is um these are the keywords and this is a very important keyword over here okay and over here 18 light bulbs Okay, one second. Okay, now you're done. So now, um, now right, so I hope you understand the question what they are asking for. So they're asking for what's the length. Okay, so there's a total of 18 light bulbs, so they are saying equal distance apart. Okay, so so this this area over here this distance is equal to this distance is equal to this distance is equal to this and is equal to this and this so it's equal to everything okay so keep in mind so now now they are telling us that along three sides of a b b c and c d so 18 light bulbs are only set up at three sides a b B, C, and C, D. Okay, let me highlight those slides. So, this side. Okay. This side. And then... This side. And then this side. Okay. So, this is... These are the three sides that they set up on okay so okay I hope you understand that now so this is our rectangular platform I hope you know that and then the breadth of the platform is 260 cm okay this is the breadth and so they are asking us to find the length the length is C B or B C okay the length is B C okay so that is our aim to find so first look at the first step the number of gaps equals to 18 minus 1 which is 17 what do they mean by number of gaps so on these three sides right on the three sides um there's 18 light bulb set okay on these three sides that's 18 light bulb set up and between Two light bulbs there is one gap okay so between 18 light bulbs there is 17 gaps let me represent you and explain with, to you using the breadth okay so the breadth has one two three four five light bulbs okay one two three four and then five okay so these are the light bulbs um if they are 
sorry that they are not the equal distance okay so this is equal to this over here and this okay and is equal to this over here okay so these are all equal lengths okay equal 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 okay so now in order to find the number of gaps right we take five light bulbs minus one which is equal to four so there are four gaps one two three four you can count it and then over here 18 minus one equals 17 so there are 17 gaps so this is how you get it okay so i hope you understand that okay so now that we understand the number of gaps now we can find the number of gaps in the breadth so the number of gaps in the breadth is 5 minus 1 which is 4 okay so what other information do we know so the the other information that we know is that the breadth is 260 cm that's the only other information that we know that the breadth is 260 cm so let's use this so now that we know that the number of gaps are 4 in the breadth we can easily find one gap by taking 260 cm divided by 4 okay which will give us 65 cm okay so one gap is 65 cm so let's find the perimeter of the ab bc and cd all together okay so a b c d all of these lines we are going to find it but we are not going to find this line except this line because the perimeter the 18 light bulbs are not not on this line so there's no light bulbs so we are only going to find the three sides okay only these three slides so in the three sides there's 17 gaps so we find 17 gaps which is 17 times 65 because one gap is 65 right so which will give us 1105 cm now it is really easy to find the length because we know the breadths which are 260 cm right so two breadths are 260 and 260 both sides okay so in order to find the length in the three lines over here the three lines over here there's two breadths and one length so if we take the perimeter of these three lines minus the two breadths it will give us one length so that is exactly what we want to find for this question so basically we take 1105 minus 260 minus 260 which will give us 585 cm so this is the answer for question 5 okay so the question the the concept on gap and difference rely on the number of gaps okay so i hope you understand my explanation for question five thank you and bye bye i'll see you in my next video bye